Hello, everybody. Welcome to Project Cars 2. My name is Jeff Aviano. We're doing a race at Road America in the Aston Martin Vantage GTE in the Pirelli colors. Should be a lot of fun. Uh, going to be an interesting race because the weather is going to be overcast. A thunderstorm's going to blow through, and then we're going to get light clouds. That is what's going to happen. Ten laps at Road America. I am in my Oculus CV1 uh, in VR, so I figured that would be a lot of... Uh, it. This game does VR brilliantly, so that's the reason why. Opponent settings, uh, we've got the field set at 97 uh, with an aggression of 70. They're pretty tough, um, but we're going to be starting on the pole position. Uh, rules and regulations, that's what I'm rolling with there. We're going to be doing a rolling start, so... Let me try to get down to the start menu. There it is right there. And let's get out to the track. All right, so we know a thunderstorm is going to be coming through. So let's go to the tuning setup. And what we're going to do is we're going to edit the setup. We're going to actually load one once it does its thing here. And I have one called wet. And basically all this does is it's going to put wet tires on my car. So we're going to start the race with wet. Uh, no, we don't need for that. We just have it loaded now. All right, up the hill here at Road America. So we got a BMW coming up on our side here. Oh yeah, that's a BMW. Let's get a good start here on him. Rolling start. Green flag. Man, my, uh, oh, God, somebody was trying to do a pass in the grass back there, it looked like. Uh, I was going to say, my G27 left paddle is getting sticky. Might be time for a new wheel, honestly. I've had this thing since 2012. All right, so we went with the wet tires because we know a thunderstorm is going to be moving in. And that's going to change the entire way we attack this race. Uh, Project Cars 2 has a thing in it called Live Track 3.0, and it's basically a dynamic track. Uh, the rain will come, it'll leave puddles on the ground. Uh, on top of that, well, I should have not taken that last corner in second gear, it was my fault. Uh, it'll leave puddles on the ground, but what's really cool is where the racing line is, where you see all the cars running, uh, that will actually stay dry for a few laps until that water completely consumes it which is really cool. These are my fastest sectors on the track, normally. Into the carousel we go. We gotta be careful on, you know, cold tires. If we go too hard in the carousel, we're just gonna drag those tires across and you'll see smoke billow out the back. Race towards kettle bottoms. Here's the kink. You gotta lift a little bit for the kink here, get back to it. The AI seemed to really sweep me up through that part. But down to this part of the track, this is where it gets hairy whenever it rains, man. Thunder Valley. And I believe this is the Bill Mitchell Hill. Overdrove it a little bit in the corner. Now, sometimes the AI won't uh, take wet tires in the beginning, and they'll duck off on pit road when it starts to rain. So we'll see how many of these AI actually, you know, waited it out. Or who decided to do what I did and put wet tires on it from the get-go. There's the Briggs and Stratton Bridge. But if you're on the fence about this game, um, I plan on doing a proper review on it. Uh, I've got to say, it's 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 like we got a, a sim here, like an actual simulation, uh, more so than the the previous Project Cars. I didn't think the previous Project Cars was that sim in a lot of respects, but uh, this time around, it is absolutely awesome. It even has like a similar feel. To eye racing, I would say it's kind of like eye racing with grip. <laughs> That's what I would call it. Um, I, I enjoy having grip. Good evening, 
by three seconds over second place. That's great. Keep pushing. Keep the gap. You got it. It'll be real easy on these tires. I don't want to ruin these tires before the rain comes, you know? Got a good gap on. We'll check that in a minute. Once we get to the straightaway, we'll, uh, on the front stretch, we'll check our information panel. Hope y'all been having a good weekend. Mine's been a lot of fun. Hate to tell you this, but there is a major downpour expected in the next few minutes. Oh yeah, there is. And that guy, oh, I was looking at my rear mirror there. Need to drive the course here. But yeah, no, that guy was, uh, he's, he's making moves on us now. You see him in our rear mirror back there just a little bit. You got a rear mirror and you have a, a camera there, which is pretty cool. All right, let's look at our information here. Currently leading. Looks like a two second gap. Really cool stuff. Trying to maintain this lead for now. What's really cool about also with that live track is, you know, the collection of water make these huge puddles uh, and you really have to avoid them at all costs, especially at these speeds. You hit that and you're going for a ride. There, there's just absolutely no grip because you are completely hydroplaning the car. Yeah, see, I was hitting my, uh, my left paddle there going boom, 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 boom down and it, it just wouldn't do it. So something, ooh, overdrove that corner. Doing pretty good so far. Because these AI will absolutely spank you if they get around you. I'm just uh, kind of capitalizing on the sectors that I'm good at right now. The AI have been improved. They have been improved uh, since the last one. There's st there's still a little wonky here and there. Uh, each track kind of requires different settings. You kind of have to fine tune it from there. It is really getting ready to come down here. Got light drizzle on the windshield. Our headlights are on. Second place is making some uh, gains on us here. Not sure how what the track is. See, it's it's not too bad right now. It's pretty good. Yeah, those guys are coming too. They found some speed in the later on in the race here. Should have apex that corner a little earlier, but that's all right. Now the rain's coming down. <laughs> and the dynamic weather is so cool. Uh, you can do endurance racing now and multi-class cars. Okay, easy, easy, easy. You see that? You see how ever overdrove it into the mud a little bit there. It's gonna allow them to catch up. You just can't make mistakes in the rain. That's how you lose races. I'm gonna stick with third gear right there. Otherwise they'll sit there and just spin the tires. Oh yeah, it's already getting wet out.
Back into the carousel. I gotta be careful. Don't run off the edge of the carousel here. It's kind of like drifting a little bit when you give it gas. We're all right there. Just keep it together. This is one hell of a downpour, man. <laughs> Okay, there's a pedal forming on the right side there. You see how the car just got really, really squirrely there when it hit it? This is a very treacherous turn in the rain right here. Linda Valley. Just don't make any mistakes and we'll be all right. Yep, they're making gains on us here. Look at those skies. That is so cool. Oh, puddle, puddle. Woo so you got to move that racing liner around to avoid those. can't even sometimes you can't even get all the way to the side of the track you know oh that's water oh yeah that was water you can't get far to the left side of the track to apex your corner because there's a massive puddle there you really have to watch out for those oh yeah look at this i'm just kind of in and out of all these see if you can try and break away from the one behind oh we got, got a lake down there. here on the right look at that and another lake right here we're all right, though. They had to slow down for it as well. But I've been having a ton of fun with this game. There's just so much content that comes with it. So many cars. And so many tracks and configurations of tracks and... You can do any car racing. It's just a lot of fun. I'm very, very impressed with it. I haven't got to do too much with the online because the online was kind of down on the first day it came out, which I figured it probably would. So that makes sense. Oh, watch out for that lake there. So. You gotta remember there's a lake on the inside of that. Whoa, hello. Hello. That was a big moment right there. Another one. Another one. Okay. This is starting to get really treacherous really fast. Oh, we're okay. We're okay. Okay, hold on to it. We're, we're okay. We're okay. Just keep it going. Keep it going. Straight. Oh, dude. Come on. There's a light tap feels like it's just cosmetic damage. I do have full damage on, so gotta be careful with that. Making these mistakes in the rain, man. I told you this just changes everything. There's some water there. We just gotta stay focused here and try to get a good finish. We can catch the leaders again. We can do it. We already know we're pretty fast here. Watch out for that big old lake. Yep. Down this hill. Watch out for the huge puddle that's up here on the corner. Remember that from the last lap. Yep, it's right here. Yep, we just hit it. That's okay, though. Stick to the middle here and avoid them. There's one there. There's one there. One, big one there. We know we have a huge one down here. Everybody's going to be slowing down for this one. And actually okay, capitalize on it. On I'm here, I'm Going here, I'm here. He's under big pressure now. Come oh, on, we hit that water. It. We're trying here. Oh, 
You see now a good spot to pass these guys down here on the hurry downs is the inside lane right here. But look, it's completely covered in water, so you really can't. You got to be patient to this part. Just can't get over how realistic it looks inside of the uh, VR. And I bumped up the super sampling uh, quite a bit. So it's crystal clear in the headset. That was uh, a huge puddle. There's a big one here on the right. Just be careful. Be ready for it. This place is treacherous down here. That was a big one there. Big one, big one, big one. Another one. Whoa, Nelly. We're okay, we're okay. Man, we got a letter. Another person got around us. I don't know how they can drive through those puddles that well, man. I can't. I am trying. Let's still get third gear on this turn. Just can't avoid that one there. Really can't. Currently P5. What lap are we on? We're on lap 7 of 10. So a lot of racing left to go here. Anything can happen. Looks like that thunderstorm is already starting to move out. Yep, just let it happen right there. All right, so I need to get into second gear on that one because we lose so much speed on that puddle. All right, starting to dry up now. Still a good thunderstorm happening right here. Yep, there's that water that we know and love so much. Whoa, you just have nothing there. I had a feeling, you know, Making a mistake in the rain was going to cost us the race, and it just might have. Although this is looking better. The track is improving. Still slick. You see where the dry outside lane is right here. Look at how much water there is in that turn. That's just insane to me. Come on, find some grip here. Puddle. Now you can really see those puddles in the daytime. The in front, sort of oh, no, yeah, you couldn't even avoid that one if you wanted to. I don't know how they're driving through them. Okay, they're avoiding them a little bit. That Corvette just, I mean, had no problem getting through that huge puddle. So I don't know what that was about. All right, we have some dry conditions now. It's gonna change up everything in the race. There's that big puddle there. Granted, you know, we have the weather set on a uh, times multiplier, so we can show off the weather. You could have it all set to real time and it would be like real time values of the track drying out and everything. Oh, we're all right. We got to stop hitting these damn puddles. Still there. Okay, we've got some pressure coming from behind. Start thinking about the phone. Uh, I'm ready for it. I'm to pounce on these guys down here into this turn. All right, water, you need to go bye-bye. You have ruined my race too much. And the AI don't seem to be affected by the rain at all. Like, they're just driving those puddles like 
a Sunday drive. They're like, ah, it's, it's all right. Why are you slowing down, dude? I mean, it just doesn't seem like it affects them. I would like to see that changed. I mean, if I, if I lose grip, complete grip in those, they should too. Okay. Hold on to it. We're just falling back because we're dealing with the water that they don't have to. That's fun. Oh, dude. You mind? Clearly doesn't. Screw it. I'll go the outside of the mirror. Muscle my way past them. I had to. Didn't have too many options there. Oh, they're pitting. They're going to be getting uh, slick tires, it looks like. With a few laps to go. This could be our big break. I say we just stay out on wets and hope for the best here. I mean, cause there's still some puddles, you know, we are currently leading the race. Okay. No mistakes. No mistakes. This puddle needs to go bye bye. Yeah, be sure to let me know in the comments if you want to see more uh, VR races. I, I really love doing these races in VR. I just don't know how they are for viewers, you know. Okay, dude, we know there's no there's no grip. We know it. Got it. Somebody went off the road there. I guess they, they pulled in. I don't know what they did there. I, I assume that's what they were doing. It's just they're changing tires. Avoid that one. Straight. When you hit these puddles, you just got to keep that wheel straight, you know? I don't see them yet. have a look here I have 20 seconds on the field yeah I don't know why they they pitted that doesn't make sense to me well we will because I don't know why the AI pit it's one hell of a race man I thought we threw it all away I really don't know why they pit though Oh, I thought I'd see somebody back there. They are gaining on us big time. The difference in stopping and getting slicks on. We just can't screw up on this lap. And it's such a big track, it's so easy to do that. Yeah, there's water there. Water there. Are you kidding me right now? Come on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Come on. Come on, dude, get it in gear. Wow. 
That fucking puddle just destroyed us there, man. I'm... I was just talking about it. Don't make mistakes now. They definitely caught us. No more mistakes, Jeff. Come on. It's pretty much our race to lose at this point. See him back there yet. Come on. If you've got anything left in the tank, now it's time to use it. Push as hard as you can. Okay, so we're close on fuel. Maybe they stopped for fuel. I mean it's possible. Even after everything we had to go through today on this race, we are going to take it home with a win. Yeah, they're two seconds behind me. Got so lucky I got it going again there. And that'll do it here at Road America. Look Great at that. Job. You were the best down there today. First Woo! class. First class. Yep, they're coming across the line right now. Look at that. 219, 213, 216, 14s for their best laps. Yeah, they were they were kicking our butt there for a little while. But I don't know why they pit. That's a, that's a strange one to me. It really is a strange one to me. View the replay. Uh, track side. Oh, cool. You can actually watch it from up here. There we are, that bright yellow one. And then you sit around and hang out with people. Hey, how you doing today? Yeah, oh yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, I'm going for that yellow car that uh, is going to be gone pretty much forever now. And that was just when we were just starting to get up to speed. So uh, I'll wait until they come back around for at least one time so you can see how fast they come by the, the start line. Look at the, the flags waving in the, the air like that. But yeah, no, like I said, I, I plan on doing a review of this game. So if, if you've been interested in it or you're on the uh, fence about it, you can uh, simply uh, check out uh, my video and, and see if uh, if I can uh, explain to you the pros and the cons of this game. But we're just going to hang out here on the banister and wait for the field to come by. Here comes the field. I can hear him. I don't see him yet. Oh, there they are. That's me right there. Look at that. See how spread the field was. Corvettes. The McLaren or is that was that a Ford GT? I couldn't really tell there. But uh, anywho, that's gonna do it for this video, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.